There's one of the new extra cycles with a smaller wheel in the back. A bike I consider to be my own invention. But this one's extra special because it's got uh, electric assist on here, which looks like it was just put on here. Didn't come this way. But um, I was canning. And I converted my um, crappy, um, huffy, pass-through frame bike into virtually a rolling shopping cart. So, um, it occurred to me that, um, and I, I know the um, physics of this was off, because I thought that if I could... Um, short, uh, extend the wheelbase out three inches on a regular bike. It's perfect here. Three inches back, three inches down. I could put a 20 inch wheel on the back and there's the owner of that bike. And so that then I'd be able to have, which is virtually that bike there. I don't want to show the people riding it. Hello. Hi there. How are you? But um, anyway, so my idea for the bike was three inches back, three inches back, three inches down, and then you'd have a 20 inch wheel in the back like this extra cycle has. And my idea was that I would have been able to put it on a bicycle rack on a bus. But I was wrong because where um, the bicycle rack thing doesn't meet it up all the way back here at the very back end of the tire. It meets it about here for the back end of the bicycle rack type deal. And so, if um, where the rack is concerned where the front wheel is and where um, basically this back end of this wheel would be. So if you had a smaller wheel back further it would be even worse because you've got a smaller diameter wheel and so if you had a smaller wheel on the back you'd actually technically need to have it slightly forward from where this is so anyway you know that's my story of how it is I created the bike that that pert lady is driving off with right now because it was kind of my idea but then again I don't have money to make such a thing at a large corporation.